right? That's 20 years of measurements. They were all wrong, and I have to eat humble pie. That's not easy, but it has happened in some cases. One of my fav favorite stories about this is uh, the, fir the first exoplanet that was ever claimed, a planet around another star, uh, one of the first ones. It was um, wrong. So it was, it was a, a pulsar that had a planet, a supposed planet around it, on a six-month orbital period, so exactly half the Earth's orbital period around the sun. And they saw this signal in their data, this, this pulsating star was doing something weird, and they figured out there was a six-month period around it. So the, the dude published this paper, uh, Matthew Bales, brilliant astronomer, and he realized later on it was wrong. And instead of it being a real planet, he hadn't quite corrected the orbital eccentricity of the Earth. So the Earth is not on a circular orbit. Its eccentricity is 0 0.0167. It's a tiny number. But that number hadn't been accounted for in the calculation. And so he had to stand up in front of hundreds of astronomers at this famous IAU meeting, and he admitted he was wrong. And he got a standing ovation. Oh, for good doing. for him. It's yeah. awesome. It's one of the few times I've heard someone doing that. And I think it's dope. I think we need to encourage people to Well, with something that. that's so massive and is such a puzzle, this is just bound to happen. Yeah. If you get people that are rigidly attached to their belief systems in, in terms of like a very limited understanding of a fantastic thing that is almost beyond imagination. When you think about the, yeah. the, the sheer size of the universe and the age of the universe. I mean, when we're talking about aging and we say 13 billion or 22 billion, th those numbers don't even register in your mind. They're not real. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's like that you see a one and a three and you kind of get it, but you don't get it. There's you no you way. can't intuit it. No. no. Yeah. It's not possible for our puny little minds to imagine 13 plus billion years. It's just too crazy. So if you're rigid.